Hi, I'm Ethan Blaze Alarms, and this is System Test 4.5. So, to quickly explain something here, 0.5 system tests are not going to follow my regular system test schedule, where I release them every other Saturday. That's not going to be the case. They're going to be released when I record them, similar to some other um, videos, which actually I haven't done yet, so I uh, ignore that. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's going to be released whenever I record them, along with any other non-system test videos I do. If I do a non-system test video, it gets released once it's done being edited. So, yep. And the same thing is going to apply to this video. It's not going to be on any schedule. So here we have the 4004, as always. Uh, first, something has changed with the 4004 since system test 4. Do you see it? There's no troubles on the system anymore. Yes, the battery trouble is gone because I actually did the little hack where you take auxiliary power positive and just feed that into battery positive. So yeah, that works with this panel. Uh, so yeah, no more annoying battery trouble. Yay. All right, and otherwise, other than that, not much has changed in the system other than the voice messages. Uh, all the pulsations and alarms are the same, only the voice messages have changed. So, when I pull this pulsation, it'll be pretty much the same message as last time, but the tone will be the code 3 low frequency sound. Um, simplex voice evacuation. And when I pull this one, it will actually be a notifier voice message instead of a silent night voice message. So that'll be nice. Over here... I don't have another Siemens message or Cerberus Pyrotronics message to go with it, so this is doing the classic 4003 simplex voice evac. So the old one with the very old uh, tone and stuff. And then over here I have another EST message. It's going to be a different EST message. The tone is going to be the same though. So without further ado, let's start with the simplex T-bar. Perfect. Uh, so I did actually decide to just use the just stupid screws on that. They get stripped really easily, so hopefully I don't strip them bad enough. But yeah, th that wire nut situation was awful. And secondly, I also don't have my laptop recording for a second angle this video. Um, but if you did like it in System Test 4, let me know. So that way I can keep doing it. If you do like that second camera angle, do let me know. Uh, if you don't like it, let me know. So that way I know whether or not I should uh, put it up uh, for future system tests. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to switch, switch that out. Swatch, switch that out. Uh, and then uh, I'll, I'll be right back. And the message is now the notifier message. It's some random notifier message that I put together. Um, so here we go. your attention please may i have your attention please the fire alarm has been activated in the building the fire alarm has been activated in the building please proceed to the nearest exit and leave the building may i have 
have your attention, please? May I have your attention, please? The fire alarm has been activated in the building. The fire alarm has been activated in the building. Please proceed to the nearest exit and leave the building. <coughs> Oh, nice timing with the uh, reset. All right. I'm going to get that swapped out, and it's going to play the old simplex message, and I'll be right back. All right. This has to be one of my favorite messages. I don't know why. I just love the old simplex message. So here we go. I hate this pole station, by the way, so this is going to be fun. Last time I took a couple of tries to get this thing to properly reset, so it's nice to have done it first try without any re-alarming. So I'm gonna swap, swap, I can't English today apparently, I, the same mistake twice. I'm gonna switch it out for the EST message, I'll be right back. Alright, that is done, and let's come over here and pull the Edwards 278B. station. That message was a little staticky compared to what it is in the audio file because like all these messages here I sort of put together myself um, using whatever little bits and bobs I could find on the internet um, and this particular one apparently has some staticky during the message which I don't know I usually cut all the static out as much as I can and that static definitely isn't there when I play the audio file on my computer, so I'm not sure. But anyways, 
Uh, yeah, I forgot to reset that pole station that I tried to reset the system, but luckily this panel will refuse to reset, and it's not like the 4001 will. It will reset and then go right back into alarm. So that's nice. Uh, but yeah, that is system test 4.5. Um, and I will also be recording system test 5 today, so that'll be fun. It won't be released today, of course. Uh, that'll be next week. Uh, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the like button, and uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe to the channel. I uh, really appreciate it. Uh, yeah, bye everyone. Bye.